Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are reacting to Steel Magnolias. This is a Patreon pick, and the only thing I know is that I'm gonna cry. That's what I'm told. <laughs> Actually, I think they said I'm gonna ball. So, <laughs> the genre for this pick was make me cry. That was the whole point of this genre. And uh, this one won pretty overwhelmingly, actually. This was a pretty one-sided. There's five picks, and I think this got, like, over 50% of the vote. So, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything about it. But I'm going to pull up a poster because I want to know what's going on with this thing. Let's see what the poster says. It says, Steel Magnolia, sometimes laughter is a matter of life and death. Okay. Uh, Dolly Parton is in it. I know Dolly Parton, of course. Sally Field. Uh, how do I know Sally Field? She is... She's Forrest's mom. And I think I saw her in something else. But I don't know what. Let's see who else. Shirley MacLaine. I don't know her, I don't think. Daryl Hannah. Mm. She, I don't know which one she is. That sounds familiar too. Olympia Dukakis. I don't know her. Julia Roberts. Julia Roberts. Hmm. Nope. No, nope. but the Daryl Hannah sounds... Oh, 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 I know who Daryl Hannah is. She is the one on the bottom because she was the daughter in Grumpy Old Men. I know her. But I don't know Shirley MacLaine, I don't know Olympia Dukakis, and I don't know Julia Roberts. I don't know those three. I don't even know which one's which on this poster. <laughs> I have so much to learn. I am so sorry to all the people yelling at me right now. I know you're out there. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have a lot of movies to watch. <laughs> Speaking of that, this was a Patreon pick, as I said, and the way it works, Patreon, is you give me a monthly fee. Uh, it's not a large fee, and you get uh, rights. The lowest level, you basically get to help pick which movies I watch, and then there's a second level, a third level, a fourth level. Anyways, there are Patreon exclusives over there. I watched the first season of True Detective, and I'm on season four of Breaking Bad, and Holy crap, is this series amazing. I've been enjoying Breaking Bad so well. I don't know. I, I I just so enjoying it, but I've been recording it specifically for Patreon, and I've considered releasing season one on YouTube, but I just don't know how I would like cut it together because everything I'm talking about is for Patreon members, so it wouldn't make a whole lot of sense. I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm going to have to consider it, though, because it's so good, and I'm really enjoying the series. Other than that, yeah, let's, uh, let's watch Steel Magnolias. Just so everyone's aware, so they're not worried about me. I am drinking my tea this morning, and I've got not one, but two bottles of water, so I have extra little eye juice in case I get really sobby. Oh, look at that beautiful house. Yummy. Oh, cake. Oh, taste of the cake. Don't stick your finger in a cake. Oh, okay. We're getting ready for something. Oh, jeez. Where those guys Oh, <laughs> they're trying to get rid of the birds. Yeah, this was definitely a long time ago. They must be blanks, but that's not the point. You should have drowned him at birth. You should have drowned him at birth. Are you a nail? Oh, you sweet thing. Come on. Pick up my green dress. Am I a 
interrupting something? Just screaming at my husband. <laughs> Rubbers. Jonathan's planning to cover the honeymoon getaway car with these. Please stop him. Keep your voice down. Oh my gosh. Obviously, we're the bride. I'm gonna talk to you. Talk oh, look at him go. <laughs> Don't you decorate your sister's car with condoms? It's like talking to a brick wall. There must be a better way to get rid of those birds. You're the one that told him to get rid of them. Oh, that's true. There you go, lady. Oops. I'll see how. Yeah, I was hoping you'd catch that. Your technique is really good. I think your form and content will improve. You've just landed yourself a job. <laughs> Yay! Well, just look at me now. It takes some effort to look like this. Oh, I can see that. <laughs> I don't know if that was a compliment or not. Ruth Robeline. Now there is a story for you. Oh, she's got the trash on everybody. I'm going to with that. <coughs> <coughs> He's got a lot of blanks. Hey, those are great little cars. Suzuki, the Jeep wannabe. Get back over to Aunt Laura's. It's bad luck to see me before the wedding. You know you won't go through with this. Is she having cold feet? My daddy catches you in here. The question of whether or not I can carry your children will not matter. So you're going to marry me. She's very lovely. I'm gonna make you very happy. We'll see. We'll see? Give me the sports. We're off to Truvy's. Oh, she put the gun away so he couldn't use it anymore. It's Miss Weezer. Back door. Back door? They're trying to get away from her? Open the door! I know you're in there! There's somebody at the door. They want nothing to do with her. Pulling! Oh, I know the guy. I know this guy. I have such a bone to pick with you. <laughs> He's antagonizing the dog. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got a little work out in the backyard. <laughs> Hi, Miss Weeza. Oh. Hi, Miss Weeza. Is that what it is? Weeza? Oh, my God. <gasps> Look at all the blanks. God, I hope they're blanks. I gotta scare away about five zillion birds. If I don't, I'll have to deal with my wife, and I make it a point never to deal with my I never <laughs> want to deal with my wife. So the dad is the, the what's his name, from Top Gun. So I do know him. Well, Malin, looks like you're ready. We can trust the nail here to do that. Does your dress have to go over your head? No. <laughs> you do not want to hear this from your hairdresser. You made a very good cat, Sheldon. Look at all the eggs. Are you going to quit your nursing job? Never. She should not work after she gets married. You should not be on your feet all day long. You should be kinder to your circulatory system. Your circulatory system? Holy crap, look at all that hair. There are still good times to be had. That poofy hair, man. Holy cow. What are your colors, Shelby? Pink and pink. My colors are blush and bashful. I have. I, have, I just don't know. Uh, this is a very woman conversation, and I don't know what to say. <laughs> Sanctuary looks like it's been hosed down with Pepto Bismol. Oh no, Pepto Bismol's not a good color. Three bridesmaids. Nine. Nine. The groom's cake. Hidden in the carport. They have a groom's cake. <laughs> it's awful. It's in the shape of a giant armadillo. An armadillo? It's unusual. It's repulsive. Red velvet cake. Blood red. People are going to be hacking into this. <laughs> Jackson comes from a good old southern family with good old southern values. It's simply outdoorsy, that's all. Uh, they're outdoorsy. Ragging on you don't mean you can get lazy on me. Hold your head. What is going on? Shelby! Malin! What is going on? Truvy, there's some candy in my purse. Eat Shelby, Shelby, juice is better. What is going on? Please drink the juice. No! There no. you go. She's a diabetic. Oh, she's diabetic. I'm gonna leave. Oh, I'd love to see you try. Frank, please. There you go, there you go. Dr. Mitchell told her children are possible. Don't talk about me like I'm not here. Jeez, had to get her sugars up. Shelby's afraid that Jackson will be throwing away his chance to have children. Oh, she can't have kids. 
There's plenty of kids out there need good homes. She's diabetic and having diabetic fits, which isn't good. Oh, I'll we'll fix it. We'll fix it. <laughs> that poor thing. <laughs> oh, that was a little scary moment. Gonna get rid of some birds. What are you gonna do now that she took your gun? <laughs> You're gonna use that? Oh my god, look at all the eggs! There's so many eggs! Wait, you can't put those on top? Lord, give us strength! Oh goodness, her with the dog again. I have found it! I am in hell! Good morning, Weezer! Weezer! I've got to talk to Malin about her husband. You know, I used to think you were crazy for marrying that man. Now I realize you must be on some mission from God. <laughs> He's a real gentleman. I bet he takes the dishes out of the sink before he pees in it. <laughs> Men are the most horrible creatures, honey. They will ruin your life. <laughs> he just vanished last week. Most of my clothes were in the trunk. Police keep questioning me. I need a job in the worst way, and my personal tragedy will not interfere with my ability to do good hair. Of course not. I really don't think things could get any worse. Of course they can. <laughs> oh no! Cherry bombs and firecrackers? Holy crap, that's gonna put a ruckus. What's that suction cup supposed to get to? There we go, that'll do it. What the hell? And that'll scare the crap out of the birds. And start the tree on fire. Oh, there goes the dog. Supposed to be good luck. Daddy, it's time. He's deaf. <laughs> oh my god, look at the pink. Oh, that's way too much pink. That's a lot of draping too, holy crap. That was expensive. The bridesmaids and groups, well, there's so many of them, they have to stack them behind the pastor. Her mother and I do. He's deaf. <laughs> He's deaf. Promise me you'll think about it before you make any big decisions about family. I know what you're saying. I don't know what she's saying. A cherry coke. Here's the best cherry coke in the history of the world. Calories, calories. Calories, calories. Oh my gosh. This small town. Oh my gosh, the armadillo cake. Oh, got the tail. Got the ass end. Nothing like a good piece of ass. Yeah! <laughs> Yay! Oh. They found the gun. <laughs> Covered with condoms. Oh, to have brothers. If you and Jackson want to practice safe sex, you're all set. Yep, you are. Very lovely wedding. Oh, this is the uh, Cherry Coke guy. Like a ride. Merry Christmas. What is going on? I thought it was Easter. Did we fast forward? Oh, my. Look at that. Love it. I have never gotten one of these, but that looks good. Corn in there. We're definitely in the south. You really should try one. We've already pulled their little heads off them and everything. <laughs> well, my hair is not the only thing that's changed. What's happened? I went wild. Drinking, smoking, <laughs> Jezebel. She gave me a place to live. What's Jackson giving you, do you know? Furniture. What's it for the living room? No, for the nursery. She's pregnant. We wanted to tell you when you and Daddy were together. I'm pregnant. She's not happy. So what's the problem? Congratulations. She's not happy about it at all. How bad are her health problems? Why diabetes? People with diabetes can have kids. What does Jackson say about all this? So excited. I mean, when doctors and specialists give you advice, he listen. I know you never do, does he? So, obviously, the pregnancy is going to be difficult for her body. And she's been told not to have children? No judge is going to give a baby to someone with my medical record. Okie dokie. I want a child of my own. 
So she, her medical condition is so bad a judge wouldn't give her a, a, a baby to adopt? Mom's not happy. Mama, you worry too much. Diabetics have healthy babies all the you time. You are special. There are limits to what you can do. There's got to be more than diabetes. They just don't know what it is or something. I'm going to be very, very careful. The one thing that would make me happy is to have a baby. When it's all said and done, there'll be a little piece of immortality with Jackson's good looks and my sense of style. Very excited her mother is not helping. I would rather have 30 minutes of wonderful than a lifetime of nothing special. And she's just pissed because she could possibly lose her or something. Is that what this is all about? Or the baby? I think your elves have gone berserk. Your elves have gone berserk. Oh no. Miss Weezer. Oh, here's Weezer. Oh, the poor dog, his foot is stuck. I met an old friend of yours, Owen Jenkins. Do you remember him? He remembers you. He goes to First Presbyterian. His wife just died recently. He's moved back down here. He was not a bad fellow, but I managed to run him off. I'm not crazy. I've just been in a very bad mood for 40 years. Oh, <laughs> she's in a very bad mood. <laughs> Weezer. Well, I made the dress with my own two hands. That's a pretty good job if you make it yourself. If you can't say anything nice about anybody, come sit by me. Oh, jeez. They're gossipers, horrible gossipers. Oh, no, she brought him. Is this the guy? Owen Jenkins. My God, you look different. <laughs> you look terrific. I'm not as sweet as I used to be. Is that it? <laughs> that was the meeting? That was, that was it. Well, then what's wrong with you these days? You got a reindeer up your butt. <laughs> I love the way they talk to each other. You got a reindeer up your butt. Worry, honey, I'm not going to tell him you're pregnant. I'm just going to tell him <laughs> I'm going to be a granddaddy. At least dad's excited about it. And the doctor said Shelby couldn't have children. The doctor said she shouldn't have children. This baby is not exactly great news. Hmm, yeah. I really wish I had some words of wisdom. I love Dolly Parton. She's so damn cute. That which does not kill us makes us stronger. Yeah, together. Look at that support. Nothing pleases Shelby more than proving me wrong. Yeah, <laughs> They'll do it together. Third of July. Oh, the baby's here. Wow, it was a baby boy. Great. <gasps> he doesn't know what's going on. A one-year-old party's for the parents and friends. I had nothing to do with the kid. I want to get my hair cut. I feel the need to make things as simple as possible. I'm gonna cut her hair back. Hey, March, dear. What is that? Yeah, well, what is she doing? Saran wrap? I know nothing about how women do their hair. <laughs> I'm okay with that. <laughs> I don't know why you would saran wrap your head. They've been smoking everything but their shoes. <laughs> Ta -da! Does she like it or no? Please don't cry or I will too. I have a strict policy that nobody cries. <laughs> yeah. The support of a mother. Amen. She prays at the drop of a hat these days. <laughs> Since Mardi Gras. Oh, we're in Louisiana. I thought we were just in the South South. Here's Weezer. But why are you in such a good mood? You run over a small child. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, honey, what have you done to yourself? Shelby, it looks like you've been driving nails up your arm. What is going on? Shelby has been driving nails up her arm. <laughs> it's my dialysis. Dialysis? Too much strain on my kidneys now they're kaput. Oh no. So I'll just have a kidney transplant, I'll be fine. A kidney transplant? Mama's gonna give me one of her kidneys. Oh, that's so nice. When? We check in tomorrow morning. And they didn't know about it in this small town? Oh my God, I wanna see the prices. How much is it? I'm gonna be jealous. I love watching older movies and they show the prices at the store. T-bone steaks, four sixty nine, sixty $63.95 for something. What the, why are you buying so many beans? Oh, drum brakes, they're a pain in the butt to replace. You gotta adjust everything in all the damn springs and everything, what a pain in the butt. <laughs> That's not funny. Something was funny. Mama, give me all your internal organs. Yeah. <laughs> 
been playing Go Fish? Go Fish. Movie. A classic. A tale of two kidneys. <laughs> a tale of two kidneys? Wait, who? Oh, Dion. I'm gonna have to turn the hose on you. Yeah, exactly. Look at the old car. Oh, it's so pretty. I just love the lines of the older cars. Yep. Everybody's there. Oh, she's over praying. Looks good. Looks real, real good. Good. Doctors are amazing people. You know, it's humans are amazing people. What we can be trained to do, huh? Oh, it's Halloween. I have always wanted to give a wedding shower with the moms. Oh, she's getting wet married. I like this little journey through everybody's life over a few years. Ooh. Weezer, you have the handwriting of a serial killer. <laughs> Fed baby Renz, but I haven't fed Alex, okay? Oh, okay. Oh, we're working in the baby ward. Treated something. Uh-oh. Well, that's a little stumble. And let's go in and make some spaghetti. Ah! Oh! Uh-oh. Did she hurt herself? <laughs> what is going on? Shelby! <laughs> oh, baby, just right Oh, no. Did she have an attack? They got her to the hospital. She's alive. Oh no, she's ventilated. She's in a coma. Doing a little PT. Okay. Doing our Jane Fonda. The exercise is a good form. Yeah, this isn't gonna be good, is it? Oh, hospitals. Such good things and such bad things happen there. Is he gonna take her off the machines? Oh, gosh. That's a tough decision. Did that say 36? 35? 32? Yep. She's going to be a mess. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, she's going to have to be a grandmama. Take care of that baby. But she got... Over a year with our son, so she's gonna take care of that baby like nobody else. Oh. She was right the whole time, and she's gonna be pissed about her whole life. Shouldn't have had the baby, but you know what? She got to be with the baby for an entire year. Smaller town like that, the whole damn town will be there. I got my eyeball juice right here. Everybody's mournful. Pink flowers. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh. I'm so mad I don't know what to do. Will he ever know what she went through for me? You'll tell her. You'll tell him. What? No. <laughs> I've always been ready to go first. I don't think I can take this. I just want to hit something. I want to hit it hard. Here. <laughs> hit this. <laughs> Hannah, are you high? <laughs> Hannah. <laughs> this is your chance to do something for your fellow man. <laughs> Belen, you just missed a chance of a life. <laughs> Waka waka waza. Waka waza. <laughs> waka waza. Or a pig from hell. <laughs> waza, don't leave. <laughs> you are evil, and you must be destroyed. <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Oh, you are too twisted for color TV, Claire. You're too twisted for color TV! Some of these southern sayings, I love it. You are evil and you must die. I'm glad to see the two of you made up. You're in my prayers. Yes, Anel, I pray. I have suspected this all along. For me to come to one of your churches. It'd probably make me eat a live chicken. Not on your first visit. <laughs> Spoken like a true smart ass. 
There's a love-hate relationship there. Oh, he likes that. If this baby's a girl, we like to name it Shelby. Oh, that's nice. I'm tickled pink. <sighs> Life goes on. Yay, we're back at Easter again. Where it all started. Grabbing eggs. Hopefully they didn't get crushed by the trunk lid. <laughs> oh, we're pregnant. Open them up. What? Two locations? On the chain! Oh, through those bushes and hop over to where the kids are. I'm going to tell you a story. Evil, ugly witch named Weezer. <laughs> oh, Weezer's got a date. Run on down. Hmm? Oh, here comes Weezer. Watch out. It's your old pal Weezer. <laughs> oh! He smacked her! <laughs> he saw her. Okay, women have babies every day. Go have a baby. Get your tail hopping. Drive the Easter buddies <laughs> taking a motorcycle. Okay, well, let's talk about it. That was Steel Magnolias, and it's a very lovely film. It's, you know, a sad film, obviously, but there are some great, very, very funny parts. It was just this nice little film about the you know what about six seven people and their lives and how they all combine and you know all their different lives how they affect each other and it was nice it was very good um i recognized multiple people throughout which i was pleased with um what can i say the death is very very sad of shelby but it's also expected I mean, they talked about her health issues the entire film. And uh, kidney dialysis, and then having her kidney replaced, and yeah, just... She was warned not to have a child, but she just, she wanted that child in the world. And she did get to spend a year plus with the kid before she died, so maybe she got that wish. I don't know. That grandma, I guarantee, she'll take care of that baby more than anybody in the whole world. loss changes you it really does oh okay there goes the tears uh, anyways thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this reaction give it a like <clears throat> thank you for, for my, my to my patreon members they picked this movie as something that will make me cry <laughs> good job <laughs> You succeeded. Way to go. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Just thank you so much for all the support that everybody's given me. I do appreciate it. It really helps. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. And don't ever forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.